Alright guys, another video here by myself, Silad, doing another build, but this one's going to be um, on houses, so I thought, everybody has farms, but we need to have houses inv involved with, with the farm or nearby, so I thought what we'd do is go through a couple of demo builds, and uh, to help you guys out, see if it helps you out on your farm, so... A lot of maps have houses and things built in already from the modders. But if you're not happy with that and um, you take it out or you're on a map that hasn't got anything of like no man's land, which I'm on now, uh, you can make your own. So that's what we're going to do today. I'm going to run you through it. So let's go. So first things first, you want to make sure everything's flat. So as you can see, I've flattened everything. I'm always going to keep this as my blank canvas so as it's easier for everybody. And then what I'll do is I'll show you the next one after. Um, so, quick as possible, what we're going to do is go into decoration. And you got a, if you download some packs, there's a decor pack, a buildings and all that. You can, you can get a lot of stuff. So we've got a load of stuff there. But what we're going to go for is farmhouses. Uh, as you can see, I've downloaded a fair few selection. Um, obviously, Alien Jim's got some on here as well that you get with the generic old shed and stuff. Um, we're going to try with this house. This is going to be like a modern build. Um, so, first things first. You want to probably face it the way that you want the uh, to be. So, we don't usually have... Um, we don't usually have the door facing the front we never see many buildings like that but what we're going to do is have it like that so there we go so you only can have one on the map so that's going to be the front of the house rather than that so i just think it's a nice looks better um next thing we're going to do is we're going to plan our radius of the house so what we're going to do is we're going to go on to landscaping and go painting right i want to get i'm going to start off with using this I don't like that's too white that looks a little bit better the other option we can use gravel let's use gravel it looks like looks pretty good actually so for now just go around the house make it look nice I would say about two squares out get yourself a little plan there we go that looks pretty good right the next phase is what we're going to do is we want a garden so okay so i'm going to put the garden here Okay, this is where the garden is going to be. Okay, so let's take this back a little bit more. That looks about right. Just going to add a bit more edge on that. There we go. So it's nice and straight. Okay. So we can take. I'm leaving that there so we got like a so we know how big the garden's going to be. Next thing we're going to do is. So we've got that in. We've got that in. Now the now the other thing is is to do our um, fencing. 
So we're going to go to our fencing. We're going to put the fencing around our perimeter, um, which will be taking this one. So I, okay, so that's the outside. Okay. So some of these, as you notice by that, left, uh, right to left on some maps, we'll be placing it down, and left to right is the other way. So it just helps if you if you got an idea which way it's going to be facing, as you don't want it to be going like you don't want it to be going like that on the inside. As it looks good for you, but it doesn't look good for them. So we're going to make sure that it's the right way. Okay. I'm going to bring it up to here. Okay. Same with this side. See, it doesn't do it. So we have to do it this way. I don't know if that is straight. It's not. This is the other thing you see. You got to be careful with the uh, if it's straight or not. So what we're going to do is to make sure it's straight. I'm going to go back on to landscaping, I'm going to go to the painting tool and I'm going to just draw a line to follow. From there. You can see that's straight, so that's where we're going. So I'm going to use that as my guide. Um, fences. Where's ours? This one. There we go. There we go, that's fairly straight. It doesn't matter if uh, it, lo it looks a bit off, as it is a bit difficult to try and judge. Now, we don't need a lot of this extra stuff at the beginning of the house. It's just so you, it gives you more of a platform to work on. Uh, so we're going to bring this in. and it, I'm going to just go straight across to there, but we're going to do it this way. Okay, does that look straight? That looks fairly straight. Okay. As you can see, we haven't got any gaps at the moment, but it's fine. That is fine. Because with this little tool, we can make an opening. Okay. So we don't have to put we could put a fence in. Like so. And then all we've got to do is go to here. I can get this to work. Trying to get it bang on. That's one way round. 
so you have to be careful you see sometimes when you do spin it around it can catch you out that's not too bad there we go that is not too bad that is not too bad that's pretty decent so there's our house next thing we're going to do is if you remember at the beginning of a house you get the road you get the grass so that's what we're going to be doing now um so the next thing you're going to do is go landscaping you're going to go painting and then you're going to put your grass in i recommend one two three and put your grass in Okay, there we go. Just trying to make it nice and clean. There we go. That's that is. So there you go. You got a bit of a. Oh, I need a bit to uh, go over that. There you go. So, as you can see, there's a a nice grass area, and then you're going into the house. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to place some things down now, so as it looks a bit more good. So we'll have a nice shed in the corner, or something. I would say have a nice shed here. Give it a bit of room. Um, got a garage you can have, so you can have those there. I I'm not sure whether I should go for something different though. Um, so let's have a look what we've got here. We can use. Okay, so we've got a kids swing. If you got if you want to have children stuff, we can add that in. Okay, we've got some nice little play swings there. Um, what else can we put in here? We've got a nice log bench. So if you want this over here, let's say you've got something going on. A nice bench there. Um, we'll add the flowers in afterwards. They're usually pretty good. Um, so you've got other houses here but these ones are not for going in so they're good for like they're just placeable down but you can't actually go inside these I don't know if you can go inside this house but some you can go in some you can't um, also we've got wicker chairs which are pretty good uh, especially for outside and things it's entirely up to you, how you what you want to place down. You've got deck chairs that you can get. That, I got that out of a pack. Um, there we go. So you could have. So here. This could be like. Yeah, you could have like a bit of a dining air, like a little outside dining area. Um, what else have we got here? There we go. We could put like a little mini. Make sure I've got this in the right area. There we 
we go. Looks really nice, and it, it just adds something to it. Um, if it was snowing, you can add snowmen and various other things. If you want to make it look cool and round, just put like uh, make it look really good. You could actually put like a couple of watering cans there. Rusty old uh, wheelbarrow, you know, just adds a bit of um, I I call it flavour into the mix to things. Um, and you got some cars here that you can get from a pack. Let's put a nice. Uh, let's get a van in. Let's get a van in. Um, so this could be the front of the house. This could be the car park here. Okay. Um, so yeah, you got loads to choose from. I think that was pretty much it, the cars. You have lights as well. This is also a good, nice feature. So there's various selection lights got them, which are a bit big. I'm not a big fan of those, but it, it depends what you want. Those look more like stadium lights. Some get a bit more crazy, but um, you got different ones you can add. These look quite good. Add them there. So you have got a fair few you can add. I'd, I'm going to put a little light there on the corner. Cause it just helps people you know like if you think about it in real life you want it to look like resemble real life so it's kind of like having something there so they can see um i think that's pretty much it for what we want next thing we're going to do though is we're going to go into landscaping and i'm going to put a pond in as like i say it's always a good feature on no man's land if you haven't got that then there is a pack you can get which you can decorate your own pond which I believe it was on here. I flip here we go. Different ones you can add in. Different things. Okay. I can't add this in here because it you've got to dig down and do it all out. So we'll go through that in another video, but they're just other things that you can use. Um so Let's do this. So we're having a nice pool here. We don't have swimming pools. This is just a pond. Nice pond, I would say. More than a pool. But same kind of stuff. There we go. So that is... Just run over Try and level this off a bit. Then I'm going to smooth it off by doing this. Just making it bigger. I'm just going round it. Just getting them edges nice and smooth. Okay, look at that. Where's your pool? Okay, so next thing what we're going to do is I'm going to show you how to put a feature in the middle uh, as well. So I, th I thought I'd surprise you, put something else in here. Okay, so you want to go... It, 
in the middle see it's just just getting over there just keep going around wiggling around oh, okay now it's now we're just seeing its surface now this is where the action happens okay so you can see it's just there move it around a little bit just getting a bit more area there we go now what we do is we're going to slope it off there we go Okay, so it's just just peeking through. Okay, don't worry about it if it looks a bit a little bit untidy. Uh, it wasn't it won't matter. Reason being is you'll see in a minute what I'm gonna do. Okay, so what I want you to do is we're gonna go to plants. We're gonna go straight down to here. I'm just going to cover it all over. Just trust me on this one, guys. Okay. Then you're going to cover a bit of grass in it. Go back over it with some bushes. Maybe just the smaller ones if you can. There we go. Once you've done that, you want to go on to painting and you get some brown. Just dash it in. Not too fancy. Okay. I'm going to take it round that side, just covering all this bit here. Makes it look real good. There we go. There we, that, there we go it's starting to look really cool next thing we're going to do is i want you to put a real a tree in there there we go look at that then it looks really good next thing what you're on you're going to need to do is going to go to decoration um i don't know if you'll have these but uh you can pick them up from somewhere uh which are stones um so I've, uh, probably one of the decorational packs they've got going on the model definitely is really cool to have um would recommend them there we go The only problem is though, it could get rid of some of your foliage. So just be aware, as it has with mine. But what I'm going to do is, I'm going to try and add it back if I can. That's the trick of this game, is try and trick it. So we're going to try and trick it and add some grass or something in. There we go. Uh, we have got some other bits we can add. So I mean it you can add it in around it. It just makes it look good. That looks really good, right? So the next thing we need to do oh, we haven't got any flowers on here unfortunately, but what we are gonna do is we're gonna go on to decorational and We've got some other little bits we can add. 
to make the pond look really good. So this is going to make it even more fantastic to what it is. Uh, so I've got some little bits and pieces here. I'm hoping it doesn't affect the ground. As you can see, it sits in. All right. Okay. Never tried this before, so we'll be doing this on the fly. Okay. What I want you to do is I want you to go all the way around, and unfortunately, because I'm doing this with you guys, we're not going to speed it up, so. You're getting it proper live version. If you like. Add one of these in. Mix it up a bit. Put one of these back in there. You can see they interlink into each other, so you can kind of make it like really good. All right, so how it's how it's starting to look now, starting to form, isn't it? Only problem is we can't see this side, so. There we go. And here I'm going to chuck this one in there. So it's going to fit just nice and snug. And then look at that. Looks pretty impressive if I don't say so myself. Next thing we need to do is we're going to have to add some grass in as it's going to look a bit weird otherwise. So we put the grass in around the edges. We're going to go and paint that other bit in a minute. It, I told you I always deliver guys. Remember that. I'll try and bring you the best content, the best little tricks of the trade of a farm sim. That's what we're all here for, to learn all the best stuff. And this is where the magic happens. Right, let's get this on. There we go there. That is looking pretty sweet. Next thing we're going to do is we want to make it so fortunately we don't have any other grass. So I'm going to put that in. There we go. Um, okay. I'm going to have grass up this side. Grass there. go 
So next thing we need to do is I'm going to use this and just watch. Okay, so that's the play area. Looks pretty cool. Next thing we need to do is I'm going to use this. Okay. There we go. I'll make this look a bit better so it's not so there needs to be like a small path there we go and here Will be where plants will go. Hold on a sec, just get rid of this bit. That's it. Okay, so I'm just going to put some plants in trees and whatnot. Um, it's too big. So, no, we don't want those. Got something a bit more. Something a bit less. Um, they're not too bad. Uh, what can we use here? Put one of them there. Another one there. And there. And then there. That's huge. Do that. There we go. I need a few plants, but I can't figure out where. I'm not quite sure. What to use because we've only got grass. All right, let's see if we can put some decoration flowers in then. These are more for like shows, but um, let's put these in. Uh, 
There we go. It's looking pretty smart now. Looking pretty good, guys. That's how we do it. So, almost there. Almost there. Right, landscaping, paint. Okay. Put that in there. This is going to be the the back part of it. Decoration. We want others. We're going to do a fence. We want a little wall if we can. If that's too big. We want smaller if we can get it. We get smaller wall. That's not too bad. No, not quite what I'm looking for, but hey, I think we might have something here. Look at that. Looks real nice. And just to make it even better. Because I know that. For a certain fact that if you. Are, that there is going to look very horrible. That there. That there. So I always like to try and like distinguish those. As it looks good. Um. So, I think we're almost at the end now, chat. I think um, we're all pretty good to do it, pretty good to go. I think, I think this looks really good. And um, there we go. I think that looks really smart. So there we are, there we have it. We're just going to tidy up this little bit here that I messed up um, before. As we don't need the, if we're going to put plants there, then I, I put like dirt down, but we don't need that anymore, so we can get rid of that. Okay, and we can run the path to there. There we go. Let's add some more grass in just to make it look better. There we go. And that is our house, guys. Just going to have a little show round so as you can see it. And that is it. That is your house. That is all you have to do. That is literally it. How look how look does that look? Every angle that you want. And you can add little bits to it, add things up, download different packs. That is just absolutely cool. Another video from me, guys, there. So I hope that's helped a few of you. That's one of our designs. I will give you some more house designs on the next video. And maybe something else. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to sub. I'm also live on Twitch on Wednesday and Thursday and sometimes at the weekend. So make sure you check out when I go live. Really appreciate the support. And... Don't forget to give this a thumbs up as well, as we know this was a really cool video. Um, 
so I'll see you soon. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment below if you really enjoyed it. And um, see you on the next one.